Good morning, morning Saints, Saints, and happy Thanksgiving. Hey guys, what are you thankful for? I am thankful for Kairos. I'm thankful for a delicious Thanksgiving food. Ian, what are you thankful for? Well guys, personally, I'm thankful that it's Tuesday! And happy birthday today to Andrew Mortimer, Morgan Richardson, Tysic James, and Senor Carlisle. Saint of the day today is Saint Leonard of Porto Maurizio. Saint Leonard studied medicine under his uncle, but decided to drop his studies in the field and pursued education at the Jesuit College in Rome. He then joined the Franciscan Order and was ordained in 1703. He is known for his work in increasing devotion to many things, including the Blessed Sacrament, the Sacred Heart, the Immaculate Conception, and most of all, the Stations of the Cross, as he set up the Stations of the Cross in over 500 different places, including the Colosseum. The verse of the day is from Isaiah 12, 4, and you will say on that day, give thanks to the Lord, acclaim his name among the nations, make known his deeds, proclaim how exalted is his name. The prayer club has two activities going on today. First, during STA period today, again, join us for Friendsgiving. Come to room 143 in English Hall to make gratitude bracelets and work on some coloring sheets. Then after school today, join us in the chapel to pray a decade of the rosary in Thanksgiving. There is no better way to end this short week of school than praying with some friends. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, we don't know yet. On Friday, our Spirits Dance team performed at the 5A state competition. For the fourth year in a row, they made it to finals, beating out 12 other teams. They placed fourth overall at that competition before making their way back to school to perform and cheer at the football game. We are so thankful for all the hard work these girls put in and the commitments they make to support our sports teams and school as a whole. However, their hard work isn't finished yet as they prepare for nationals in the spring. Speaking of the Friday night football game, your Saints took on St. James in the sub-state game, winning with a final score of 24-17 to to advance to the state championship game this Saturday. We are so thankful for all the great games these boys have played this fall, and your hard work and dedication to the game is evident. Keep up the good work as we are hoping for a great game on Saturday. And then on Saturday, the Saints cheer team had their state competition. With their first performance late in the evening, they qualified for finals along with five other teams. With one more demonstration of their talent even later into the night, your Saints cheer squad took first place overall to win state for a third year in a row, back to back to back. We are so thankful for the year-round commitment from these girls and for all the spirit they bring to so many spring sporting events. Now let's jump back to the topic of football. That's right, we have one more game this season, and this one is for the state title. Your Saints take on Hayes on Saturday at 7 in Emporia. The game is at Emporia State University. It's about an hour and a half away, so grab some friends, get some road trip snacks, and make your way down to Emporia. The theme for the game is blue and gold, so wear your climate's colors, bring some spirit, and maybe some hand warmers. To tell you more about the weather conditions come game time, here's Christina with your final game day weather. Saints, it's Tuesday, but in case you haven't figured it out yet, we're going to state. So, on Thanksgiving, it's going to be a high of 38 and a low of 26. But on Saturday, it's not getting any better. In Emporia, it will be 30 degrees out, 30 degrees out at kickoff, so make sure you bundle up. The theme is blue and gold, or as I like to call it, try not to get frostbite. So, make the drive, pack the sand, and support our Saints. We are so thankful for Christina getting here early and making these weather segments so everyone is ready for the games. Thanks again. The Asian Culture Club is selling merch right now. Scan the QR codes here or on the TVs in the halls to buy a shirt or crew neck, or both. T-shirts are $16 and crew neck, sweat crew neck sweatshirts are $26. Proceeds will help the club to put on more fun activities and part of the profits will be donated to charity. Make sure you purchase yours today. Attention! Anyone interested in attending the Poetry Out Loud competition for our freshmen, it's being held today in the theater during the first block of SDA. Come out loud, come out and see <laughs> which of our 10 finalists will move on to represent St. Thomas Aquinas High School at the Poetry Out Loud Regionals for the Saint, uh, state of Kansas on February 1st. Evan starts this Sunday, Saints. After Thanksgiving break, we'll begin preparing our hearts and homes for Christmas. Come help the French Club decorate the French Room for Christmas. Join us during STA period on Tuesday, December 3rd, the first day back after Thanksgiving break. Check the group meet or talk to Madam Trader for more information. Over the first two weeks of Advent, we'll be doing prayer partners. This will be a Secret Santa style prayer activity. This is a great opportunity to deepen your faith and friendships. There is a $10 gift card up for raffle for one person in every grade who participates. 
Scan the QR code on the screen or find the QR codes around the hallways to sign up. Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We hope you have a great Thanksgiving break and we'll be back with more for you next week. I'm Greta. I'm Ian. And I'm Jordan. Signing, Signing off. off. Remember, stay classy, saints, be thankful, and pass it on.